welcome back to my channel as you can see i am now home from my holiday i'm not sure if i ended up uploading my vlog from morocco because of everything that went on there if i haven't cut a long story short i've been away on holiday to morocco it was really really nice although obviously there was a tragic earthquake that was there whilst we were there we were mildly affected but i'm very grateful to be home and safe it was scary but of course yeah we're very lucky yeah i just wanted to address that that's where i've been my thoughts are constantly with people affected people who lost family members people who lost homes um yeah it's been a terrible terrible time for a lot of people um but i'm gonna leave a donation link down below please donate if you can i know things like this happen in the world so often and it's just terrible but obviously because we were there and we witnessed it a little bit more it just hit us a little bit harder so yeah if you can please donate it's actually friday currently um friday the 15th of september and luckily it's a nice day we've come back to some sun I'm kind of excited for autumn now um i caught a little bit of a tan but yeah i i'm excited for a little bit of hopefully not straight away but cozy weather and doing some autumny things i've got some exciting things launching on my day um which reminds me i've got some parcels to post actually but yeah i just thought we could vlog getting back into things um i thought i'd do a pr unboxing because i've come back to so many parcels one of the ones i'm most excited for is hello fresh i'm gonna be making this for dinner tonight and honestly the best time to order hello fresh in my opinion is when you're coming back from a trip or a weekend or just somewhere where you really don't have the energy to decide what you want for dinner this turned up today i obviously ordered it so it came today when we got home and i haven't done a food shop yet i probably won't need to for a few days because i've got this box now maybe like a few breakfasty things but yeah this is just so convenient because i'm knackered we had a very delayed flight last night as well i have a discount code for you guys so i'll leave it on the screen but let's see what we've got because i always um forget by the time they arrive i forget what i've ordered and it's like a fun little surprise to find out what meals i'm gonna have yes <gasps> yum okay so we've got spicy spicy cajun prawn risotto which is this one i love to try a new one if i can the butter chicken masala yum that sounds really good i think i'll probably have that tonight um i think i've had this before but that sounds really good and that only takes 15 minutes wow this is part of this super quick um category on the back it has all of the instructions this one's really simple it's only got four four steps some of them have got a few more um and it's also got all of your, all of your macros i usually get them for two people um because obviously usually it's just me eating or me and my boyfriend you can get them for three people or four people if you're in a family um i think i might have gone for four people this time actually because i'm seeing family over the weekend so i might cook for them as well um this one is spiced chicken and, and pepper bulgur which looks really good as well this one is calorie smart so this one's under 650 calories and it says very hot don't know if i saw that before but hopefully it's not too spicy i'm very excited for those but yeah i think i'm gonna go for the curry they are all numbered so as you can tell that one is number seven this is number seven in the bag and i just pop the bag straight in the fridge like this for ease so that when i want to cook i just look for the number and pull out the bag so i'm gonna pop these all in the fridge now so one is a big box from cotton on they emailed me not that long ago about their um new foundation which is not foundation as in <laughs> on your face but it's a charity um that looks after mental health and it sounds amazing and they've partnered with lady gaga's charity which is born this way foundation yeah for the, i think it's for like a couple more weeks i think they're doing it for a month in total um they're sending profits towards the charity and also they wanted to send me some new 
autumn clothes which i'm so excited about i love their stuff i hadn't really seen or tried their stuff before they took me to cornwall a few months ago um and i fell in love like their basics are so comfortable um and, and pretty affordable like for the quality i think they're great price probably will do like a little try on reel or tiktok or something with all of these clothes maybe like some styling videos first thing i've seen is a coat and maybe it's too early but i saw this coat and was like i love that i love a puffy coat as it is and i love this color oh my gosh how nice is that oh and it's got a hood a lot of my coats actually don't have hoods which is so impractical but i just thought that'd be so cozy and we have a tote bag this is a really nice colored tote bag a lot of mine are like beigey but it's kind of like almost green denim their underwear sets are so comfy they're just so soft i think that's the best way to describe the material i hate anything too like structured as well like in a bra or whatever like i don't really wear wired stuff and this has no wires in it it's just really soft how pretty is that like almost like abercrombie vibes then i've got a tracksuit these feel so soft and a matching hoodie love a zip up hoodie then we've got some really nice basics these tops are so soft this is like a black ribbed basic oh my god they've absolutely spoiled me this is the type of stuff i love how cozy does this look like a knitted jumper cardigan type thing a bit of me that would go cute with the coat actually oh a long sleeve i love a long sleeve when it's soft and like just with joggers or trousers that's really cute i just love the rib it's almost like brandy melville as well like abercrombie those types of places <gasps> these trousers look so cool they're like tailored suit trousers they would go really nicely with this actually the long sleeve top for like a nice cool casual comfy outfit another really nice basic white long sleeve finally thank you so much cotton on honestly new favorite brand like most of the stuff that i wear um day to day is cotton on these jeans these look gorgeous i love the color and they've got a nice badge at the back i love when jeans have that and then they just kind of go straight down wow whenever i get new bits like this as well obviously i've already got jeans i've already got long sleeve stuff so i will be continuing to upload on vintage because yeah i don't need doubles of everything next we have this one which was actually open so hopefully it's not been damaged or anything my neighbors must think i'm crazy hey ellie we love your content on socials hope you enjoy using your new brita oh my gosh oh i'm getting so old and boring oh my god i'm actually so buzzing with this and i've i've been meaning to get one of these but i've just been like no i don't need it it's fine this is a water filter jug so you just put like tap water in and it filters your water no i'm so i'm too excited about that thank you so much this is from iris pr company and yeah the brand is brita brita i'm not sure i've not heard of it but that is so exciting and a water filter bottle <sighs> yeah i'm definitely getting old yay thank you guys this one is elf some of them do actually say the brand on oh wow this looks like a good package the stay all night setting mist i don't think i've tried that the power grip primer i don't think i've tried that but i've definitely seen that on tiktok the halo glow liquid filter i love this it's like a charlotte tilbury dupe but i have a really light shade and this is actually really fitting because it's probably a good shade for me right now the lash roll lash and roll mascara and the satin lipstick thank you so much elf Ooh. big gloss energy <gasps> wow what a gorgeous parcel so we've got my jamma beautiful she's the face of rimmel at the moment celebrate with rimmel london and experience our glassy gloss scents with a little cocktail all of these 
glosses how pretty is that i thought they were perfumes so cute oh my god i love a gloss and i can tell they're gonna be good thank you so much for them all few more oh virtue so this this is the brand some hair healing oil sounds very luxurious next we have unique avenue oh i'm excited for these a company this is the company on instagram messaged me and they do personalized pjs wow they feel really nice and soft oh my god so cute okay so we've got these pink bottoms and they're so soft and loungy and then they've got like a white trim see these are like perfect autumn pjs because they're still cool like they're not too heavy and thick but they're like they're quite cozy as well and then we've got this little shirt and it says ej so sweet the brand is called unique avenue if you want to purchase I love PJs so much. Thank you so much. Then we've got Wizard Publicity. And this is from Nude Body. I'm assuming, yeah, part of Nude Sticks. A body cream. <gasps> love the packaging. I really love Nude Sticks branding. I just think it's very minimal and sleek. Oh. Oh. Oh my God, that smells unreal i treat myself to a bath tonight because why not a nice dinner a nice bath i'm gonna catch up on my favorite youtubers my boyfriend's gone home because he's gone, to, gone out with his friends tonight i'll let him off considering we've spent a week together and i'm actually going out with him tomorrow because it's his mom's birthday yeah he can't get rid of me that quick we've got this from ren uh some more body products some barrier support body balm this is a melting body oil that intensively nourishes and targets dry rough or problematic areas of skin so i'm assuming sort of like a massage balm very very nice thank you so much yay this one is from mac oh, studio radiance serum powered foundation it's a foundation with serum which i'm assuming hydrates and sort of does a bit of skincare whilst covering your skin beautiful packaging we've got the hyper real serum which i love and i did run out of this so i'm very very happy to have a new one and um, the studio radiant moisturizing primer i also loved and ran out of this i really liked this so I'm very happy to have another one of those. A Fix Plus, which you can never go wrong with. Thank you so much to Mac. One more, which is quite heavy. <gasps> oh, no, stop. Is it really getting to that time? Our first advent of the year. Oh my gosh, I think I've had the Glossy Box advent for probably the last six years or something crazy. And every single time I get so excited to see it and you guys seeing before me oh my gosh i actually can't wait as much as i don't want summer to be over and i'm very excited for autumn i also i'm really excited for like vlogmas and oh my god don't get like decorations out tiny glimpse we can do this on vlogmas that is everything i think i did order some more coffee pods as well but i opened those first thing this morning but yeah anyway i've been filming for like half an hour definitely wanted to unbox those because Wow, I feel so, so lucky, so, so lucky to have all of this amazing stuff to come home to. I am going to spend a few hours unpacking, putting washes on, putting all of this stuff away, tidying up a little bit. Luckily, it is pretty tidy in here because I did try and tidy up before I went. But yeah, I just want to make it really nice and cosy and tidy for this evening. I don't know what I'm going to film this week, to be fair. It's Friday now. I said I'm going out tomorrow. I might film a little bit there. I'm seeing my family on Sunday as well. Really excited to see them and catch up and see my baby niece. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. <laughs> Sorry for that really long intro and I hope you're all well as well. Um, and I'm excited to get back to doing things. So I'll chat to you guys in a bit.
Okay, I've spent a while tidying up. This is what we look like. Not gonna lie, the other room is a mess. <laughs> but as long as my base looks like this, I'm happy for now. Um, I've definitely taken it very slow. As you can tell, it's a little bit darker now. I've been sitting down in between because I also feel like it's that time of the month and just everything with coming home, I'm absolutely knackered. So I'm gonna start on dinner um, and I'm gonna make the butter chicken. I've also just put a wash on which you can hear. Um, I've unpacked and yeah, I've got like another couple of loads to go. And then, then we should be pretty much back to normal. Um, I've like done the dishwasher and stuff. I need to take all the recycling down. But yeah, we've made a big dent. I'm gonna start, I'm gonna make it and then also run a bath at the same time. And then just when I, and then when I get out of the bath, I'll just cook the rice. So it's basically cook the chicken, add all of the little sauces, again, which come like pre-packaged. Um, add some spices, add some green beans, creme fraiche, which is in the fridge. And that is pretty much it. So I'm gonna put you on a time lapse. I'm gonna make this. I'll show you what it looks like. And I'm also gonna run my bath in the meantime. I also have an autumn haul from HomeSense. This isn't really autumn-y, but I did get it when I was in there. Um, and I just thought it looks really nice in the bathroom. So yeah, new little addition. But I don't know whether to do that haul in this video or not, or a whole another video. We'll see. But yeah, anyway, thought I'd show you that. Um, right, let's run this bath. Oh, I've not had a bath in so long. Quick little rinse. Okay, we're gonna do some bath salts. Some bath essence. This is my favorite one. It's so gorgeous, it smells amazing. And also this Neom bath foam, which is also gorgeous. Okay, here is what the curry is looking like. Looks and smells amazing. It was so easy. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna leave this on a simmer. And I'm gonna pop into my bath. Obviously lighting some candles. This one is a brand new one from Sanctuary Spa. It smells amazing. Oh, look at that. Dreamy. Lit one here as well. And this is my bath. Okay, I'm out the bath and I've got my PJs on and it's looking so cozy in here, by the way. I've missed my home. I always do when I go on holiday. Um, and as much as I'd love to stay on holiday for another week or, you know, forever, um, it's always nice to come home and especially have a home-cooked meal. I'm gonna serve up my curry. This has been bubbling away. How amazing does that look? I ended up just doing one of the boxes of rice. So this is only for two people. But as I said, I've not really eaten today, so I'm gonna have most of it. Oh, this is just gonna be amazing. Guys, look at this. Of course, we're gonna do a taste test because every HelloFresh meal that I do, I do a little taste test. I don't actually know if I've tried this one. I've definitely tried some of their curries and I have a feeling I have tried this one, but I'm gonna do a taste test anyway because look how nice this looks. Oh my God, my mouth is watering. Let's try it. Oh my God, that is so delicious. When you're young, well, especially when I was young, yeah. Sometimes like if my mum made a homemade curry, I'd be like, oh, can't we just get a takeaway? Or I don't know, like homemade things were never that appealing. But this, I would honestly take this over a takeaway. This is incredible. The flavors are something you would get in a takeaway or in a restaurant. Mm. Wow, I'm gonna sit and enjoy this 
and but for the rest of the evening I'm gonna edit because I've not done any work when I was away I've done bits and pieces but I've got a lot to catch up on um which I'm excited to get back into to be fair so yeah I'm gonna sit and edit and catch up on some other bits and also I'm gonna catch up on um youtube and tv and all that so i'll probably come back and speak to you guys in the morning don't forget to use my code for hellofresh i will leave all the information on the screen and down below as always but i definitely recommend this meal um and i might even show you another one in this video i have no idea how long i'm gonna vlog for but yeah i'll see you guys in the morning good night Good morning, happy Saturday. Another beautiful morning. I'm really hoping this weather sticks around for a little while. Don't know if you can see, but it's looking bright outside. I've made myself my coffee and oh my God, I can't tell you how much I missed this coffee when I was away, which is why I did do an espresso order <laughs> to arrive for yesterday. I slept really well. I went to bed at probably like half 10 and fell asleep at about 11. I did consider trying to go to sleep at like eight or nine, but I just wanted to be really tired and I woke up at like half eight naturally so a very good night's sleep I'm gonna finish off some editing I want to get my holiday prep video up tomorrow and yeah just catch up on some other little bits I'm actually gonna pop into town and get my nails done because even though they're looking fine obviously these were the nails that I wore on on holiday and they are starting to chip um, and I'd rather get them done whilst they're still a little bit intact because if I leave any longer, I just know they're going to break and I'm going to have to cut them right down again. So, yeah, I'm going to go and do that when they open. I think that's about 10. So we're going to do this morning and then I'm heading down to my boyfriend's later. We're all going out tonight for his mum's birthday. So it should be a nice day. I'm going to get ready and I will see you guys probably when I'm on my way to get my nails done. Okay, I've just come out into town. Just chucked on these jeans from Cotton On Hall and they are so nice. I'll show you them properly when I get home. Um... No makeup, just a little bit of moisturiser, sunnies. And I'm also gonna go to prep to get some breakfast because obviously I don't have any food in still. So that's the plan. Also feeling like I wanna go for French. Something simple. I've still got my hotel wristband on. Just picked up an almond croissant in prep. Also, can you peep the new nails? I went for electric blue, which is so random. I just had a quick little thought that was like, okay, summer's almost over. I need to put my rings back on, by the way. Um, and I can have French for the rest of the year. I think this is like my last sort of chance to go bright. And I just thought, YOLO, let's go for it. And he did put a different blue on at first. And I panicked and was like, no, I'm not sure. Um, so this is a little bit darker, but it's still very, very bright. I don't know if you can fully see, but yeah, I really like them. They're, they're fun. They're different. So this is the colour we've ended up with. Just walking home. Mm. Great start to the day. Okay, I'm home. This is the colour. <laughs> What do you think? I feel like it's kind of funky. It's kind of different. And yeah, I just thought, why not? So that's what we've gone with. It kind of looks better with the rings as well. I'm just about to head out now. I've just chucked my hair up and I'm gonna pop some makeup on later before we go out for dinner. Um, we're going out in Canterbury to a place called Socialite, which we've been to before for drinks, but never had food at. So hopefully it's good. Um, it's like a rooftop bar and it's really cute. And also that prep, almond croissant i don't know if i've ever had it before but it was honestly one of the best ones i've ever had i don't know whether it's because i've missed like uk coffee shops and i've been craving it so much or if it was just amazing but 
I really enjoyed it. But yeah, anyways, I'm heading out now. I will show you what I'm wearing later. I've just got like a sleeveless blazer that I think I'm gonna keep on with these jeans. These are the jeans, by the way, the ones from Cotton On, and they are just so comfy. They fit so well. I really love the wash color as well. But yeah, let's go. A little bit later, I am ready to go out for the evening. Just wear my makeup, put a few curls in my hair, and this is what I'm wearing. Where can I put you? I don't think I've ever vlogged here. So I'm just wearing the jeans that I had on earlier. These are a little close-up of them. They're so nice. And then this sleeveless blazer that I've had for years is from misguided i want to say and it's actually part of a suit but i don't know if i have the trousers anymore um but yeah looks quite cute and then i'm just wearing these sandals it's actually really warm today which is nice to come home to that's my outfit and also my little denim bag i'm taking this and it goes so well with the jeans so yeah very cute little outfit and we are about to go so i will show you guys what we eat and what we drink and as much as i can not sick of each other yet. Rain like Berkeley, better at Coachella. I went to see Chica, she went to see C trip. Perfect. I took the seat on the ice bowl. Hi guys, happy Sunday. I am in the car, as you can see. Um, this morning I've been to watch my boyfriend play football and now I'm heading to my mum and dad's because I'm gonna see everyone properly since I've come back from holiday. My battery is flashing so I have no idea how long the camera is gonna last but I've just been to Costa and I got an iced coffee. It's currently one o'clock. So I also got some lunch. I'm wearing this top that I showed from Cotton On with the Cotton On jeans as well and this is gonna be my go-to autumn winter long sleeve top it's so soft and comfortable i got a toasty i'm not really a toasty girl but today actually feels like autumn has begun i also got one of the autumn brat blondies because yeah i just feel like let me show you the weather it's so oh, i don't know if you're bad to see it i'm sorry but my camera died so here we are on my phone um yeah the weather today really feels like autumn has has well and truly arrived um so i wanted something hot and cozy and it is actually making me quite excited for autumn i do like when it's cozy on a sunday and pop a film on get a takeaway which i think is what we're going to do tonight um so i'm definitely having a very sunday day of food but this is the chicken fajita or like nacho chicken toasty or something thought we could try it also i'm loving my blue nails really like them that's good mm. so i'm gonna eat this let me just try the little maple blondie as well it smells good so yeah this is the autumn menu i'm pretty sure i love me a blondie what is this rogue chocolate chip so random um, I'm assuming this is going to taste like, I don't know, to be honest, I don't know if I'm going to like it, but let's try. Mm. Mm. I actually taste a bit like coffee cake. That texture is beautiful though. Mmm. Okay. Tastes a lot like coffee cake. Very weird. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to sit and eat my lunch. And then I'm heading to my mum and dad's for a lovely family, family, <laughs> family chilled Sunday. Okay, I've sat here filming intros and outros for videos that I've just forgotten to start and finish. This is another video that I completely forgot to finish because after I was sat in the car eating my lunch, I went to my mum and dad's. I had a lovely wholesome family day and obviously when things like that happen, it's really hard to remember to vlog because you want to be in the moment and I hadn't seen them all properly in a couple of weeks. So yeah, we basically just caught up. We had a really nice Chinese takeaway. That was it really, but that was my vlog of getting back into reality, trying to sort my life out. Yeah, coming home. I hope you guys enjoyed anyways. My next content is gonna be very autumn-y because looking outside right now, autumn has honestly, with a click of a finger, 
begun overnight pretty much um, and I'm not mad about it yeah I'm very soon gonna be decorating gonna be baking some lovely things I have a very exciting launch for my day which is actually launching tomorrow for me but by the time this video goes up it will already be out that will be in my next video but I hope you guys enjoyed this one thank you so much for watching please like comment subscribe all of the above and I will see you in my next video bye